Borobudur Temple is a Buddhist temple which is located in Majlang, central Java, not far from the Yogyakarta city. This amazing historical relic is so special. How the stones are arranged and formed in such a way as to form a building with high artistic value. In addition, it has not been known for sure if this temple was built for Hindus or Buddhists. At that time, the Sayalendra dynasty adhered the Mahayana Buddhism. This temple is estimated to have been built around the time of 760 to 830 AD. It seems that Borobudur takes at least 100 years to complete the temple construction and is thought to have been completed during the reign of King Samratunga. Until now, Borobudur Temple is estimated to be around 12 centuries or 1,200 years old. This is supported by some discoveries which state that the construction of this temple began in the 8th or 9th century AD. Some historical evidence states that the existence of this great temple was neglected. This happened around the 14th or 15th century AD, when Hindu-Buddhist civilization began to decline in Indonesia. This year also marks the entry of Islam to Indonesia. Before being completely restored and preserved, the great Borobudur temple was the target of irresponsible people. They take Buddha statues to sell to antique collectors or to museums. Many parts of the temple were lost and diminished as a result of these looters. That is why many Buddha statues are headless. Borobudur Temple has undergone two restoration works to maintain its integrity. The first renovations were carried out in around 1907 and 1911. However, due to limited costs, the restoration could not be done optimally. In 1991, Borobudur Temple was designated as one of cultural objects from the past or a World Heritage Site. This temple is a cultural object that represents a creative and genius human masterpiece. On January 21, 1985, Borobudur Temple was targeted by a bomb that destroyed nine stupas and two Buddha statues. The perpetrator of this bombing was a Muslim preacher named Hussein Ali al-Habsi. Borobudur Temple was also rocked by an earthquake measuring 6.2 Richter scale on May 27, 2006. Even though the Yogyakarta earthquake almost destroyed the surrounding area, this Buddhist temple remained firmly standing without any slightest move. The popularity of this temple is not in doubt. Borobudur name is increasingly widespread throughout the world. This can be seen from the increase in the number of visitors every year. On average, Borobudur visitors even reach 2.5 million people per year.